brightest blessings everyone this is actually um, an added video from my why should we care video um, anybody who looks on two of my videos can see it was bombarded by comments from a user that goes by the singers of yore I don't know if this was another sock account by Nathan or just a crazy fundamentalist and honestly I could give a rat's ass. You know, he made all kinds of comments, was extremely rude, derogatory, uh, threatening, and he thinks he can get away with it. Why does he think he can get away with it? He or she. Because when you go on my comments section, this is what you see. Wow. I guess that means that I can't screen cap and I can't report him or her or whatever in the fuck you are singers of your but can I uh yeah what you just saw maybe what everybody else sees but you know you can set it up to whenever anybody leaves a comment on your page or leaves a comment on any of your videos it can go directly to your email which it does you made lots of comments and lots of statements threatening disgusting foul-mouthed and why was it because you couldn't vote bought me honey see I have my ratings disabled it doesn't fucking matter. Is that why? I'm sorry. Although you made plenty of threats, the two threats that I was telling you that I screen capped were these two. So basically you're saying that y you never threatened me. Well, hello the first screen cap says that we're whiny little bitches and we don't do anything and and we threaten and all that stuff but you know so you want to see you want to meet me out in the street and see how tough I am okay um, I don't know I, I think that entails a threat personally um, what were you planning on doing when meeting me out in the street to see how tough I am did you want to hold a knitting contest maybe drink some tea that was a threat that was a physical threat you want to meet me out in the street and see how tough I am I don't want to meet your ass out in the street and see how tough you are cuz I could give a flying fuck and and about the other thing uh, actually let me go ahead and read that directly um, cuz I couldn't really believe it uh, you're not pagan you're a Christian you used to be a Mormon Yet, says here, that you're saying that my curses uh, mean nothing and my phony love spells. Are you fucking stoned? When the hell have I ever cursed anyone? When the hell have I ever done any spells or love spells here on YouTube or anything like that? As far as you're concerned, I've never done any spells or curses or anything else. Where the fuck did you get that? Where did, did you pull that out of your ass? Your magic has no effect on me. Yeah, because I didn't do anything to you or your cronies or whatever. This is YouTube, honey. It's not fucking worth it. You're certainly not worth it. Oh, oh, and here's the good one. This is the part I couldn't actually believe. Uh, of of course, you know when when I do my spells, it just calls more demons upon myself. It says here, I am a demon summoner. I I send a de I I send a demon on a Mormon. Oh yeah, also this this guy can't seem to spell or speak or I don't know if it's just the way he types or if this is how he speaks. But basically, he sent a demon on a Mormon, and I can easily send one on you. Uh hello how am I supposed to take that if that's not a threat those are to the the two screen caps that I am planning on sending to YouTube and reporting you 
for threatening me. Yeah, those two were threats, one physical and one to send a demon after me. I wouldn't want to do it because if you're going to do either one of those, you better make sure that I can't defend myself because I may make you sorry that you were born. But then again, maybe I can't do anything. So are you a gambling person? But uh, yeah, so basically when I said that I could actually screen cap these things even though he or she actually removed the comments, uh, all of a sudden they got extremely upset and this is what I got. Wow, now that's amazing. Just because he or she found out that I could do a screen cap and actually forward it to YouTube and anybody else that I saw fit, all of a sudden I'm fat, which is no big surprise to anybody. But not only am I fat, but I'm a fat fucking whore. Mm. Uh, well, according to him, I'm too fat and ugly to want to have sex with by men or women, so what is it? Am I a virgin or a whore? Uh, anyway, I digress. So basically, um, point is, is that this boy or girl or it wanted to, I don't know if they were trying to play and just try to get a rise out of me or whatever, but this is a serious fucking situation and I'm not playing. I don't want to play. Go play with somebody else. This is a serious situation. You know, the thing is, is that I'm not responsible for something that pagans did way back when. I'm not responsible for things that Christians did way back when. I'm not responsible for what whites did way back when. I'm, res I'm not even responsible for what my own fucking family has done. The thing is, is that I am responsible for my actions. No more, no less. And I refuse to take responsibility for anybody in the pagan community today or in the past nor should I have to. If someone has done something to you and wrongly taken off your video or gotten a, a channel kicked or a video kicked, then you take it up with that person. There is every religion in the world has been victimized by somebody. Get over it. Christians have been victimized. So have pagans. So have Jews. So have Muslims. So basically, if, you, if someone's done you wrong, you deal with it you report it. You get them kicked off, you do. You deal with them directly, whatever in the hell you need to do. But there's no reason why you have to sit there and ask that every pagan be taken off of YouTube or leave on their own. That is bullying. That is cyber terrorism. And that is bullshit. I, I think this is a very serious subject. And if you're going to go play, go play with somebody else. Blessed be.